Well, Igor actually had me compete as an uh, exhibition match against a heavyweight Draka fighter in Los Angeles. And I had a great time because I was a wrestler before I was a kickboxer. So to be able to grapple a little bit and have a little action on the ground is a good thing for the sport and I think more exciting for the fans. So um, I, I feel the Draka is growing. And uh, uh, I like the rules, and I think they're very safe, and the organization is, is uh, very professional. So um, I wish the best for Draka and uh, Igor, and uh, the Dragon's going to participate and help us. Igor Izhov's dream fights on. Recently, he staged a Draka championship tournament outside Los Angeles. Igor Izhov wants to convert America and the world get them thinking in a new way about martial arts and willing to take the next step towards perfection with Draka. I would say don't only watch it, try it, touch it. Uh, try to let it through, go through you. Igor Izhov has also held Draka tournaments in Europe. He's already scheduled more right here in America. Oh, gosh, a while. If he's got any quick... Whoa. Down he goes, the left hand. I was about to say if he's got any... Oh, they're going to stop it. Good ball kick to the body of Ogosawara. Ogosawara still hasn't recovered. Down he and goes, that's it, Phil. and that's it. They're going to stop the fight now. I kind of feel they could have stopped it earlier, but when you're in for a title fight, they want to get... And the new Worldwide Draco World Super Middleweight Champion in the blue corner, Dimitri Jaguar Tukola! Presenting the world title bout, Draco founder and president, Igor Izhov. Well, I'll tell you, that belt right there wears well on this young man, Tukala Phil. He's, we've seen him in the past. He worked hard to get the world title. He had the Intercontinental title for some time, the Russian title. Now he's the worldwide Draka champion. Mr. Steve Nakata of Japan Sports Federation shall give this letter in honorary sword to Igor Ijov and his wife. Let's go, man. And presenting this thing will be Japan action star Ken Yasuda. Now this apparently is going to formally announce Japan's entry into uh, future Draka fights. And I think, uh, as you said earlier, Don, this is going to be a welcome entry. They have so many great martial arts fighters in Japan. The story of Draka fighting begins here, the former Soviet Union. It was here that this man, Igor Ijov, against all odds, dared to bring this revolutionary new sport called Draka fighting to the world. Today, Draka championship fighting involves athletes from 61 countries, including France, Armenia, and the United States.